By the way, for the record, he also says, I was an actor in adult films. I was also an actor in other venues, including off-Broadway, soap operas, and commercial advertisements. <laughs> Congratulations. I'm glad you're finally here, Jose. What seemed to be the problem? We're having trouble with the bathroom. You're having trouble with the bathroom? The lock is broken. The lock is broken? Yes. It's broken. You know, I'm glad the lock was broken. Do you mean what you said? Yes, I do. I do. It's not often people get to meet this way. What was meant to be, is meant to be. Say, I wonder, Yes? Do you suppose... Uh... Oh, how unthoughtful of me. Please, take a seat. First of all, I saw the clips. I am now convinced the porn industry will pay anyone to take their clothes <laughs> off. But setting that aside... I'll she don't like her eggs all runny. She thinks the crossing her legs is funny. She looks down her nose at money. She gets it on like the Easter bunny. She's my baby. I'm her honey. I'm never gonna let her go. Well, he ain't got late in a month of Sundays. I caught him once and he was sniffing my undies. He ain't real sharp, but he gets things done. Drinks his beer like oxygen but he's my baby and i'm his honey never gonna let her... because it has been my experience that they often grow up to be productive members of their community i know this firsthand because i used bad judgment myself in my youth recently materials have been circulated alleging that i was involved in the adult film industry about 40 years ago in New York. Those allegations are true. I was an actor in adult films for a short period in the early 70s. I was also an actor in other venues, including off-Broadway, soap operas, and commercial advertisements. A few weeks ago, when asked... I denied this to members of the press. I regret that, and I apologize for it. I was shocked and embarrassed to be confronted with this so many... Fat girls, skinny girls, I love them all. And they all love me. Oh, <laughs> Mark. Is it over yet? <laughs> That's what he was known as Gus Thomas. <laughs> baby, baby, no. I mean, that's... The company sent me. Fred Jarvin, male prostitute. You know, I wonder if this is how Henry Ford started out. Well, I don't know about Henry Ford, but it looks like a beginning of production line. Attorney in upstate New York by the name of Mark Subin has admitted he was a porn star back in the 70s. He's now a district attorney, admitted he was a porn star. But, you know, people had their suspicions, like the law firm he worked at, Turner, Bender, and Banger. That was a clue. Oh. You know, that right there, that was something. I'm a little suspicious. A little suspicious. Doesn't that sound like a bad sitcom? He was a porn star. Now he's the DA. Coming to NBC this fall. It's the penal code. Doesn't that sound like a, oh. like a bad sitcom? Yeah. Sister brought her new boyfriend. 